Hi, this is Gerald Salenti. It's Tuesday, March 10th, 2020, and we just came out with the New Trends Journal. That's right. Check it out. Prostitutes, puppet masters, peddling hysteria. What does it mean? Where's it going? Check out the news. Here are the headlines. Italy quarantines entire country. Isn't that great? How about New York deploys National Guard? Wonderful. Seattle readies crackdown. This coronavirus, what I'm concerned about the most, besides the markets tanking and these freaks and fools, the puppet masters, destroying the global economy, is how the police state is taking over. New York deploys National Guard. This is from March 4th. Cuomo expands emergency powers. Little Andy Cuomo, another boy like his brother Chrissy on CNN, the Cartoon News Network, born on third base and thought he had a home run. Giving himself emergency powers, now sending out the National Guard to New Rochelle, New York. Yeah, I remember when I was a kid, my father, may rest in peace, he built a new, the New Rochelle Yacht Club. And I was a young guy. I won a twist contest at the Glen Island Casino in New Rochelle. And back in the old days, you used to hear. And now, ladies and gentlemen, from New Rochelle, New York, Mr. Glenn Miller. Yeah, that New Rochelle. And now we got a clown little boy playing governor like all the other ones out there. Hey, how about that jerk? Off over there in Maryland. Yo, yeah, Maryland. What's his name? Hogan, Handjob, whatever it is. Yeah, called a state of emergency. Three people got the case. 50 people got homicides already in Baltimore this year. 20, what? Eight people, 27 people died in the entire United States of America. And most of them at a, a nursing home. Uh, somewhere in Washington State, Kirkland. And they're calling all these states of emergencies. Don't you see what the government... This is a police state. The police states have taken over. Look what happened over there in Italy. That little boy Conti, not even... I think they're spelling it wrong. They need a U where that O is. Closing down the entire country. Like these little jerk-offs know what they're doing. Yeah. I'm a, I'm a prime minister. I'm a governor. I'm a president. I'm an expert in this field. Oh, no, no. We got the flunkies, the little bureaucratic lowlives that we bring in. That's the health minister of this or that, that are telling you how bad it is. So I have a right to lock you up and throw you in jail. I just canceled the trip. I had to go to Dallas. Not that I'm afraid of coronavirus. I don't want some freak over at the airport going like this. Take this guy away, he's quarantined, just like they did on that wonderful cruise ship. Won't you let me take you on a sea cruise? Oh, yeah. And when you land, the military's there to greet you. And then they throw you into quarantine, yeah, camps. You got it? This is a military drill. It's the police state. It's right in front of everybody's eyes. It's happening. One place after, oh, can't kiss anymore. No more kissing on the cheeks. You got the orders from Italy. I'm ashamed of the Italians for not standing up and fighting. Where's the courage of the people? It's lost. So where's this going? It's going down. They have crashed the global economy. How long, if they keep this going, the greatest depression that I had forecast that would happen in 2021, it will happen this year. All the jobs that are lost in tourism, aviation, one place after another, restaurants, don't, can't go to a concert. We just passed a law over there in Austria. Huh? No big crowds could gather anywhere around the area in Austria, in France, in Italy, one country after another. So what's going on? What does it mean? What's next? It's all in your trends journal. 
This is very serious. We're covering this in detail like no one else is. It's history before it happens. It's the truth in trends.